Hello Lakers fans, subscribe to the channel so you don't miss Lakers first-hand news and leave your like to strengthen the channel. Regardless of the outcome of the Los Angeles Lakers run in the NBA playoffs, both Austin Reeves and Rui Hachimura have positioned themselves for significant paydays in restricted free agency this summer. The Lakers hold bird rights on both players, which allows them to exceed the salary cap to re-sign them. They also have the ability to match any offers from other teams since both players are restricted free agents. The team has expressed its intention to keep Hachimura after acquiring him, and there is strong determination from Jeannie Buss, the Lakers' owner, to retain Reeves after discovering him in undrafted free agency. Leave your like on this video to keep up to date with everything that happens at Lakers Thanks. Continuing. Considering that both players have performed exceptionally well and have been vital contributors to the team's success, particularly in the Western Conference Finals, it seems highly likely that Reeves and Hachimura will continue to be part of the Lakers' future. ESPN NBA insider Adrian Wojnarowski, on his podcast The Woj Pod, along with ESPN Lakers beat reporter Dave McMenamin, stated that they see no scenario in which the Lakers do not retain both players. Reeves has expressed his desire to remain with the Lakers for the next five to ten years, and the team is expected to match any offer he receives in free agency. The Lakers face challenges in replacing Reeves with a player of similar caliber while maintaining enough cap space to sign other free agents. Similarly, Hachimura has shown appreciation for his time in Los Angeles and is likely to command a significant contract based on his impressive playoff performance. The future of another Lakers free agent, D'Angelo Russell, is less certain. Russell's postseason performance has been inconsistent, and his defensive deficiencies have posed challenges for the team. The Lakers are considering bringing him off the bench, which could potentially impact his feelings heading into free agency. The team has postponed contract extension talks until after the season, highlighting the difficulty of bringing in a third high priced player under the new collective bargaining agreement. While the Lakers are in a good cap position, it remains unclear what Russell's market value will be. Both the Lakers and Russell have leverage in contract negotiations, as the Lakers may not be able to afford losing him without a replacement, while Russell may not receive a more lucrative offer from another team. The outcome of Russell's free agency will be intriguing to watch. In conclusion, it is highly likely that Reeves and Hachimura will return to the Lakers, while Russell's future with the team is less certain. The Lakers' cap situation makes it improbable for them to sign top-tier free agents like Kyrie Irving or Draymond Green. Instead, they are more likely to make smaller adjustments to the roster. Put your opinion in the comments as it is very important for Lakers I update you at any time with the latest news from Lakers. Help the channel become a member.